Welcome back here with Storyboard. Godrich Consumer Products has revamped its flagship personal care brand, Synthol. The mass market soap brand, which was launched in 1952, will be positioned as a premium youth brand that has extended to include not just talcum powder and deodorants, but also shower gels now. Animesh Das finds out what prompted the company to spend upwards of 60 crore rupees on revamping the 350 crore rupee brand. <laughs> Get ready to face another day with Body Confidence by Synthol. Since its debut in 1952, Synthol has been the brand for the alpha male. From Vinod Khanna to Imran Khan and Ritik Roshan, over the decades, Synthol has exuded confident masculinity. But that's set to change. It's now looking to appeal to well-heeled young men and women who want to be well-groomed. Shower gels, a new product category, has been added to the brand that already offers deos, talcum powder and soap. After an 18-month exercise that included consumer research, it was found that while Synthol scored high on recall and popularity, it wasn't getting fresh customers. Synthol's equity is uh, very, very strong. So I think even if you read the publicly sort of available, sort of most trusted brands or the brand equity study, Synthol does really well on those. Uh, our conversations with consumers also tell us it's a brand that does connect with uh, sort of young India, modern India. But we felt that um, in, say, a category like deodorants, we weren't actually pushing the boundaries enough. We felt that even within soaps, we had a lot more to offer. And we want to go into new categories um, like shower gels. We have some other categories planned. So we felt that we needed to leverage the brand platform much more. Kothrej hopes that the new positioning will help the brand regain popularity. It only has a 2.5% share of the 6,000 crore rupee soap market. Creative Land Asia will handle the 50 crore rupee marketing campaign, which does away with the iconic celebrity endorser and conveys a new promise. This is to move away from the masculine image of the brand and connect to the youth while retaining its aspirational appeal. Feel incredibly alive with Synthol's awesome new range of soaps, shower gels and deos. Synthol, alive is awesome. It's a brand which even though it was at the popular end of the market, it always had a premium imagery among its consumers. But the hallmark of all great brands is that they evolve with time. They have to evolve with time as generations change. And as I said, we found that there's a new young India which has emerged, which is so starkly different and so willing to live life to the fullest. And we thought this is time for us to go ahead, leverage this brand's potential fully and make this young India reevaluate our brand. The idea was to actually um, leverage on the heritage of the brand, Synthol, uh, that, that the, and the respect that it commanded at one point in time and sort of contemporize it and make sure that it's relevant for the younger audience today uh, and also at the same time move them up to uh, a little more premium sort of a segment as far as the uh, uh, soaps and uh, you know uh, personal care is concerned. With Synthol and Godrej number one as the leaders, all the Godrej consumer products or GCPL soaps together occupy 9% of the soap market. That's way behind market leader Hindustan Unilever, which has more than half the market share. GCPL is banking heavily on the Synthol revamp, and it will get the largest marketing investment this year. But marketing consultants caution that a cosmetic makeover at a price that's higher by 20% will not lead to high gains. I'm just wondering what segment are they attacking with this? Today the consumer has become extremely smart and generally cosmetic makeovers are just give you a little blip in increase in sales because that's all that happens and then there's no real growth and you're, you're not able to take a uh, share from competition. Remember Vinod Khanna on a horse galloping down the beach? Well, Synthol's revamp is looking to move away from that image. This is all part of Godrej's larger initiative to revitalize its brands in order to stay relevant to today's times. In Mumbai, Anime Stars. Let's take another break on Storyboard.